If legalized in New York State, recreational marijuana in some suburbs may be a no-no. Opting out means that it would not be legal to sell it in Nassau County. Many here reacting to the pot proposal delivered during Laura Curran's State of the County address. Marijuana is going to exist one way or another. I think there are more benefits than there are harms. It's really just a financial issue. Medical and law enforcement officials here say when you factor in social and health costs, net revenue of marijuana sales drops significantly. Marijuana got the headlines in Laura Curran's speech, but her focus on the big pictures of fixing the assessment system and developing the hub are where the real money, the real buzz that'll help guarantee the long-term sustainability of Nassau County. The one and a half billion dollar hub plan to redevelop 72 acres around Nassau Coliseum is the centerpiece of her efforts. The Long Island the hockey team could have stayed in place here. Could increase congestion and traffic in the area and that could have negative effects. Curran's vision transforming the hub with housing, restaurants, retail and high wage jobs. We have a plan now to turn the hub into a vibrant live work play destination. And she touted her controversial countywide reassessment of more than 400,000 properties. Taxes do take a toll. I think we need a uh, relief from taxes. Taxes are too high. We've had a situation where half of the taxpayers were subsidizing the other half. Half were underpaying and half were overpaying. We are on the road now to fairness, equity and accuracy. Despite a lot of criticism. Yes, there is a lot of criticism. We are cranking up the machinery of government again that had been left frozen, left stagnant for eight years. Blaming the previous administration and referring to Ed Mangano's conviction last week, Curran said she's personally sad for his family, but wants all residents to be proud of their county and government funded by their tax dollars. From Mineola, Jennifer McLogan, CBS2 News. And Curran also voiced support for the proposed hockey arena for the Islanders out at Belmont Park.